learn, 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 learn. But most importantly, learn what one of your major resources uh, is, and that's the actor. The more you can absorb what the actor must absorb, which is a different way of saying the more actor training you can include in your in your education, the easier it's going to be for you to relate to actors, to to get the most out of actors, to help them overcome a lot of the obstacles. Uh, it just it becomes a very very valuable and very necessary uh, credential to have as a director. In addition to all the stuff that the film schools are teaching, uh, one of the, unfortunately, one of the biggest omissions is the training, the actor training, that should be part of directing 101. The emphasis, unfortunately, has been a little lopsided toward the use of camera, the f-stops, all of the film stock. Uh, these are all valuable, but uh, they are not necessarily the full responsibility of the director as much as it is the responsibility of the director of photography. Uh, the director has to know, he has to know camera. He has to know what the role of camera is in, in articulating the content of, of the scene uh, and what the role of the camera is in terms of presenting the most vivid, the most dynamic images to hold the audience's emotional involvement. Uh, everything is valuable. The camera, the, uh, the, the script, the sets, the makeup, the costumes. But as I said before, it starts with making the actor as comfortable and as as willing to take a risk as you can. And that, uh, that basically is. Then uh, my other advice is get a good friend in the business to give you a hand because everybody has basically, everybody needs that.